Hi, what is good, my chosen ones? What is good, my star seeds? What is good, my angels? Hi, welcome to my channel. It's Golden Chastity. I am back again on YouTube uh, here to send you another message. Another good message that I feel like God want me to say on here. And I want y'all to know and I want you guys to like just really take this message, y'all. Hear my messages and really like take this message because this is some real life stuff, man. Like the downloads that God is showing me and sending me and it's like, okay, you know, and it's attacking me because these, these Decepticons is attacking me, y'all. Like, man, and I feel like God just want me to just speak my truth out again and know what's telling y'all what's going on. And this is some real life stuff. You feel me? Like these Decepticons, man, they want you to go down. But before I get started to this good message, I just want to tell y'all, thank you so much. You guys are my true, 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 real supporters, man, for real. Like, you guys are my real supporters. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. I am so grateful and thankful. I said a really good prayer this morning, and I told God how thankful that you guys are just supporting me, just watching my channel, and that's just, you know, just hearing my story, you know, that really means a lot, and I'm about to start getting a little teary-eyed because, you know, this stuff gets emotional, like, this stuff, like, it gets emotional and you know what I mean? Like it's beautiful at the same time, you know, my grind, my my hustle, you know, that the things that I got to do, you know, like it's, it's a beautiful thing at the same time. And I'm just really thankful because God is still here with me. God, <laughs> I said a good prayer, y'all. I said a really good prayer this morning. And I told God, I said, God, send me a rainbow, you know, and I, cause I love when God send me rainbows. Like I get so happy cause like, you know, this lets me know that like God is here and I am loved and I'm still, you know, getting my blessing that he going to give me that I'm going to receive. And so when I was done praying, you know, I turned around and I, um, I saw it. It was a rainbow. It was like on a wall. It was like a little rainbow. A little, and then it was like on a door over there. It was like a little rainbow. I will show y'all pictures and stuff. So, so you guys can see. But I really don't know how to just edit on a galaxy because I usually just you know just say my video and then I you know post it on youtube so i haven't really been editing to be honest i just you know speak my real you know so but i would edit i'm gonna try to edit this video i'm gonna learn how to edit this video because i really want to put those rainbow pictures that i took a picture of that god showed me this morning and put it you know on here so <laughs> i could just show y'all like how real god is and how god is still here you know like god is still here and it's just amazing, you know, like, God is just so amazing. But God really want me to send y'all this message for real. <sighs> I had to exhale because, you know, these Decepticons, man, chosen ones, they want you to let your guard down. They want you to let your guard down so bad so they can take over. I'm tired is I really am but I stay prayed up though we we stay prayed up we should stay even just prayed up more and more and more having just God cover us in the blood of Jesus like we, I'm gonna just keep repenting that like God please cover me in the blood of Jesus God please cover me in, in the blood of Jesus because it's like what I'm seeing out here these Decepticon these Decepticon people negative very negative like they are just so just mean like it's just a lot of devil energy around here lately like it's a lot of devil energy around here like coming like showing up lately in my life because shoot i know the devil knew where i was at a down point in my life you see but that was like a long time ago but God know that my life 
No, the devil know that my life is going to be very just amazing and humble and you feel me? It's going to be good because I put in our work. But you see, you see, he's trying real hard to take me down. Really hard. Really hard to take me down to basically, like, not get this blessing. And it's like, it's like, dang, I'm, I'm not even going to let the devil take me out of my character. I'm not going to let nobody take me out of my character. And I'm definitely not going to let these Decepticons to just basically like want me to let my guard down like no like that is not going to happen like no I'm never going to let my guard down and chosen ones I know you are never going to let your guard down you see they think that like they think just because just because we being chosen they think that we are perfect was they think that we are perfect so they just be mean it's like everywhere I go, y'all, like if I go to a store yesterday, I went to like the mini malls and um, I had bought me like a couple of things, you know, just treat myself. And like when I was at the cashier register, you know, to get my stuff and pay. And it was this man, like he was just so mean, like his spirit was just like, just really not the business like i don't know it was something wrong like with the card like i tried to no he tried to put the card in and stuff and i guess something was going on and i was like oh like what's going on and it's like he getting mad at me for some reason and i'm like okay you don't have to get an attitude at me just because your whatever that thing is not working so I just went to get some cash from the ATM and then cashed it out and I gave it to him and like, ugh, like his energy is just so just really just ugly. Like, man, when people act like that, they are, that's just ugly all over the place. Your attitude is ugly. You just ugly. Like just really just brighten up a little bit more. You just can't throw that negative energy at people just because you feel some certain way. Like, I am a customer there. And, but it's like, you see, these people are asleep, though. They are asleep and depressed and just, man, just need some healing. So, I've just been feeling a lot of negative energy around people just where I'm just, like, at. And the stuff that I'm going through, y'all, and the stuff that God just showing me, like, you know, God... The next move is for me is that God want me to move. You know what I mean? Like, it's time for me to, like, move, like, um, places so he can open another door for me. And that's what I feel like that because when God make you move from different places, like, you know, or make you move from another state or just make you move from a home or make you move like, you know, a little far away or something you know then like if you are connected and stuff and God wants you to do that then that's a sign that God you know is trying to tell you to like he's going to open another door for you basically so God is um God see me doing good like I'm doing everything that I'm supposed to do you know I'm, I'm grinding I'm working and um, God see that, and now God is going, you know, like, open another door for me. And then once this door opens, and then I already know what's next, you know. Then I'm moving to the other state that I really want to be at. So, you know, when God make you move, you know, then that means another door opening up for you. So, like I said again. So, um, I've been trying to look at, you know, like, um, just Craigslist just to find some, like, you know, rent a room or something, or just to find, like, you know, something that I can, like, somewhere that I can stay, basically, you know, that so it can be a safe, you know, neighborhood, and, you know, safe, you know, just decent people, so, when I had went to this place, you know, to check out the room and stuff, and he was, like, he was cool, you know, like, they was cool and stuff, like, they had a lot of, you know, plants and a lot of nature, you know, that's the stuff that I love, like, nature, plants, and, you know, like, all that stuff, you know, because that stuff is energy, and it's, you know, 
helps you raise your vibration even higher but you know he was real cool and stuff he could he could tell that i got a good spirit he even said that i have a good spirit and um he did tell that i'm good but it's like once the next day like you know my sister like hit me up and said that don't call those people no more and i'm like oh why she like because they playing games like they know that i really need that house that i really need to like get somewhere to stay because god wants me to go like i'm feeling in my intuition like you know like like it's time to you know so but so he was playing games and stuff like he gonna post it up on there again and asking for somebody else to you know get the room so i'm like okay you know it's just that devil energy you know people got they got that devil energy in them and they don't even know and plus like you know these decepticons be just wanting you to have your guard down so they could take over you they could take advantage over you like they try to use you try to take over your kindness like i'm a really nice person a very very nice person but you see, I got to learn how not to be too nice because I have to, every time, if I try to be like friendly or be, um, you know, like friends with someone or, you know, I can't, I can't trust nobody. You see, when you're a chosen one, it's like, you can't trust nobody. You, you can't be too comfortable around that person because that's, I don't know why they do that. I don't know why these Decepticon people do that, man. Like they want to make you not happy so you can feel just like them that is so crazy y'all i can't like just the energies and stuff that i've been feeling lately it's just been kind of just been kind of you know just making my head like hurt and it just been making me like just a little just in a storm you know like in a tower so i was in a tower a little bit but then once that i woke up today and i said a good prayer and i told god i said lord can you please send me a rainbow or something because you know i love seeing i love when god show me rainbows because that makes me feel like that god got me and i'm all right you know and it just and i i, I was really crying because i'm like god like who like you still here like i know you is you know like god you ain't forgot about me god yeah god has not forgot about me god is gonna give me my blessing man but god just want me to move from a different place now like i'm evolating like i'm coming up I'm, I'm coming up and i am doing just fine guys i'm doing really good i'm staying prayed up and i'm in my grind time i work you know, today is my day off, so I'm very thankful for that, you know, and I had time to do a video. I told God, I'm going to do a video, and I'm going to tell y'all, you know, basically, like, how the Lord, what the Lord is doing to me now, that I have to move, you know, places now. And I feel like God also wanted me to tell y'all this, that these Decepticons just want you to lay your guard down, man. Mm-mm, that can't, man, they can just keep trying it because the harder they try, the harder we gonna, like, really just stay prayed up and be in our grind and keep our guard up, man. Like, it's just so sad, like, how, like, sleep, like, these Decepticons is. Man, I just can't no more, but you know what? I'm doing fine, though. A lot of just people can want to see me fail because they can see my light everywhere I go. And it's like, I, this ain't no game, man. Like, th like the stuff that I'm telling y'all about having a high vibration and, you know, having a high frequency and this and that, this stuff is like, ain't no game because... This would be real life out here when I just, even if I go somewhere or go to a store or go to, like, if I'm out in public around people, like, and they give me that eye, like, that sharp eye that's mean. They they voice, how they talk, just mean, like, hmm. 
just a a hole, man. I can't. It, it was kind of making me mad. That's why I had to get the fan just to like, you know, but you know, I'm going to just let y'all know this though. And I'm going to really let y'all know this and I'm going to tell y'all the truth. Okay. These Decepticons cannot control us. Okay. Because we, we have too much power of God, of them to take over. I'm telling you guys, God is always wins, man. God is always greater. God is bigger than anything. The devil cannot win. And that's why I'm going to keep meditating and keep, keep meditating and keep telling God that, like, please, like protect me god protect me protect me cover me in the blood of jesus god cover me in the blood of jesus god cover me in the blood of jesus god like get these negative energies off of me like i literally have to just keep meditating and and keep repeating myself and saying that so it can go off because i really do not like negative i don't like i don't i've i've been I, a long time ago, I used to be negative. That's because I was in a low vibrational state of mindset and where I was at. But I'm telling y'all, when y'all get with the Lord, when y'all get connected to the Decepticons who just don't know, y'all need to get with the Lord. Y'all need to get connected. And I'm telling you, everything will start making much sense in this world. Everything will start coming better in your life. Everything will start to just, like, understand, like, you won't feel that way. And I'm just really proud of myself because I always kept the faith, you know. Like, even getting a connection, like, with God was, it was hard. It was tough. Like, I'm not going to lie. Like, getting a connection with God was tough, like, to get this far. But you see... I have faith though. I have faith and I needed my help. And God, you know, he builds you up so naturally. God builds you up so naturally. It's like you can't even tell that like you changing because like you just really focus on praying and stuff. Sometimes you can't tell, like, dang, like, you glowing up. But a Decepticon will always know. A Decepticon will know that you are elevating. You are becoming high to the top. They will, they will know before you. Remember that. A Decepticon will always know before you that you're going to blow up. <laughs> so, yeah. We just got to protect our energy. Y'all, protect your energy, man. Do not let nobody hurt you. Do not let no human being hurt you because that person is sad and that person don't know what to do with, with his life or her life. So they just want to they just wanna ruin your life because they see that you got something good going for yourself and you're not even just trying to brag. You're not even just trying to floss you're not even just trying to you're just trying to live your life man and have a decent life but these decepticons can't stand that man they can't stand it at all that's why they like to just steal your energy just talk to you just foul but you see we we have to keep on praying keep on praying man and I'm telling you, like, they're going to leave you alone. Like, devil has just been, oof, just been, like, on me. Like, like, just trying to take my light down. Like, you see how I just keep exhaling and just keep, because it's like, you know, I'm tired of it. Because, like, this is the last step. This is the last thing that God want me to do, man. And it's like, the devil just don't want me to win but you know what god always wins the at the end of the day yes yeah 
God always wins at the end of the day. God got you. God always going to have your back. I'm telling y'all, when I saw that rainbow this morning, I started just breaking down crying because God was in here with me listening to my prayer. And that just really means a lot to me. Like, God don't like me. God don't like to see me in pain. You know, he don't like to see me, like, upset. I'm about to cry. <laughs> he don't like to see me upset because he know how much work I've been doing. He know how positive, like, how hard I'm trying to just you know fight it like fight this negative energy off of me he know how hard i'm trying to do it you know and i and i i believe in god you know i i, I kept the faith and that's why you know god is about to bless me you know like it's so hard you guys it is so hard but i'm telling y'all that you never alone, though, because God always have you. God got you. Yeah. But I tell God that, like, I appreciate just, like, you guys, my supporters. Like, it feels good to just let everything out and, um... I'm just really just, like, thankful. Yeah. I'm really thankful. Thank you, you guys. Thank you, my supporters. Thank you, family. You guys are my family. And I just, you know, just want to keep my head up high. You know? And I am keeping my head up high, but like I'm telling y'all, like when y'all when y'all own y'all spiritual journey, it ain't no joke because like the devil loves to just try to just have all his just power trying to just bring you down. <laughs> you know, and that's what I feel like. I feel like that lately it just been the devil just been on me, like just wanting me to not like succeed and it's trying its hardest for me to just be down and be low vibrational but no those days are over but you see the harder like you know when you're on your spiritual journey and the harder it gets like the more beautiful it's going to come out though the more beautiful your life is going to become <laughs> On this next chapter that you are going to be in. That other chapter closed. You don't have to look back. I don't have to look back. God had built me up so much. And I'm not going to let any, any Decepticon. To make, to let them make me put my guard down. I'm not going to let that happen. <laughs> you want to know why? Because God is inside me. Man. Put everything in God's hands. Just watch how God work. Just watch how God work, y'all. For real. But yeah, this was like the message. This was today's message, man. These Decepticons, they want you to let your guard down. But don't let them fool you, though. Because us chosen ones, we coming to the top. And we always going to be at the top. I don't care how hard it gets. No matter how bad it is. And no matter how bad it gets. I'm, yes. Me, Chastity, is going to make it to the top. Us chosen ones. You two chosen ones. Yes, I'm talking to you. All them times that you just been crying. You been crying. Oh, especially that one summer. I was on the phone with my sister, and we were just talking about how much pain we was in the summertime, how much pain that we was in around that summer. It was so hard, and it was so depressing. 
Because that's when the devil was around us bad. But you know what? Me and my sister, we kept the faith. We kept the faith and we always believed in God that God will make a way. And now God is going to bless us, man, for having faith. And this just makes me want to, like, cry again. Like, you know, stuff just been getting so emotional lately. And it's a beautiful thing. It's a very beautiful thing, you know? Like, sometimes it gets emotional. But I'm just very proud of myself. And to the chosen ones, that y'all been some hard workers, and y'all been in y'all grind too, man, I'm proud of y'all. I don't care what kind of place you live in. I don't care what kind of car you have. I don't care what kind of job you have. It could be McDonald's or Burger King or whatever. You got a job. You making it. You gonna make it. And watch, I'm telling you, when you you gonna make it, man, and once you start praying, God gonna make you ever lay even higher, even higher. Man. So we just can't let our guards down, chosen ones. We can't let our guards down. We're going to make it to the top. But I, I, this was today's message. And I really want you guys to really take this message off. And thank you again, you guys, for subscribing to my channel. You guys are my real ones. Like, I love you guys. You guys are my true supporters. Thank you, guys. Thank you, family. <laughs> I appreciate every single one of you guys, and if you guys like today's message, please give a big thumbs up, subscribe, and don't forget to turn on bell post notifications so you won't miss any videos will come out in the next time. And yeah, we gonna make it to the top, and we always gonna make it to the top. <laughs> All right, you guys, I'm gonna go now, and I'll just talk to you guys later, like for real, like. Don't let these negative Decepticons, man. They want you to let your guard down, but you know what? We're not going to let it happen. <laughs> Don't forget who you is. Don't never forget who you is, man. Don't let these negative Decepticons take over you. Like, I can't believe it, man. Like, always be you. Okay? Always be yourself, for real. Don't listen to no Decepticon. These Decepticons is accepting you to be perfect but no just because we spiritual that doesn't mean we perfect ain't nobody perfect we don't even have to look too perfect man we don't have to look too perfect to god man come as you are to god god doesn't care that what kind of music you listen to god doesn't care if you wear makeup or materialistics or weave whatever it is God doesn't care, man. God wants you to have it, but God also wants you to keep your humbleness, too. That's what I wanted to say, too. Like, these Decepticons be wanting us to, like, look perfect for God. Like, we ain't got to look perfect for God. Huh? <laughs> like, no. <laughs> like, this mess is crazy. But anyway, y'all, I'm about to go, though, man. But just keep y'all guards up for real. Like, don't let them down. Keep them up. Us chosen ones, we stand to the top. And we're going to pray these Decepticons off. Yes. Yes. God, please protect us. Protect my chosen ones, God. Protect me, God. Protect us. Cover us in the blood of Jesus, God. Please, God, do not let any negative person come and ruin our life god please have us protected god please just keep covering us god keep covering us keep having our angels cover us too god in their wings god <laughs> i am so thankful thank you so much lord for everything i pray that my other chosen ones that they just keep doing what they doing keep grinding and me you already know God. So thank you. Amen. I just had to say that little prayer, man. But I'll see y'all later.
Bye.